Along with Best Fan Artist comes, of course, the award for Best Fan Writer. Again, from these nominees, we see that same spirit of participation and leadership that makes us who we are. And here to present the Hugo for Best Fan Writer is fanzine editor and budding rocket scientist, or at least rocket physicist, in his pocket, perhaps, John Coxon. Without fan artists, there wouldn't be fan writers, and without fan writers, there wouldn't be fan artists, but both forms are incredibly important because before the internet, they were how we communicated, and without them, we wouldn't have the fantastic community of people we see before us now. So it is my incredibly great pleasure to announce the nominations for Best Fan Writer are James Bacon, Claire Brearley, Christopher J. Garcia, James Nickel, and finally, Stephen H. Silver. And uh, the winner of this award is possibly one of the oldest friends I have in science fiction fandom. It is my pleasure to invite Claire Brearley to come and collect her Hugo. I told you. I told you. <laughs> it takes a great deal to make me actually speechless, although this comes close. In one really significant respect, though, I am literally speechless on account of it being so utterly impossible that it would be me who was standing here holding this utterly beautiful award. Stunned though I am, I'm even more overwhelmed by the knowledge that I'm following in the footsteps of such truly great fan writers as Susan Wood, Terry Carr, Bob Shaw, and everyone else who I will undoubtedly remember as soon as I leave the stage. <laughs> so I'll just take this opportunity to encourage you all to consider supporting joining us in London in 2014, where, <laughs> where I hope very much that everyone will have at least as much fun as I intend to go and have right now. Thank you to everyone who voted. <laughs>